right, Jamal. So to do a cash buyer's list, you are going to go up here and type in a zip code that you like, or it could be a city, county, you could even draw on the map. So I live in 6313 Warren. I'm going to click, type that in, and it's going to say cash buyers 478. This is just for my zip code. I live right there. So you can see here's all the cash buyers in my area. If I didn't want to do a zip code search, I could exit that. Again, I live basically right by the sea in Crystal Lake Park. A little bit south of that, but let's call that right there. If I wanted to find cash buyers in my neighborhood, I could draw on the map. I could just use an area like that. Click enter. It's going to populate that content right up here on the top. Give it a second. The bigger the area, the longer it's going to take. And when it's done, you're going to see cash buyers. Seven hundred and one of them. So it's probably that's probably too many. So again, just maybe you just start with the zip code. You can always go back and get more. Six three one three one. Cash buyers four seventy eight. That'd be the best place to start. So you can go over here to unique properties and select all. You can see all of them are selected. Add the list from there. Um, over here, I'll show you. Add the list. You're going to create new. And call it cash buyers six three one three one. I'm going to click save. You're going to go over to your properties again. You can't do this from your phone, you got to have a computer. Go to properties, you're going to search for that new list, and you're going to have cash buyer 63131. Select here, make sure all of them are selected 478 selected, and I'm going to export. So from there, 478 properties exported, it's going to download right here. So take that to your desktop. <coughs> And it's going to need to be skip trace. You can skip trace it in PropStream, or I would take it over to Batch if you're already using Batch. But essentially, here's the data right here. That's for cash buyers. So it's that simple, man. It's got these presets up at the top, and you're on the search area. And you just draw on the map, type in city, county, zip code. Um, I would start with zip code unless you want to get real granular. So let's say that you know you got a property right there. And this little pocket, I don't know anything about this, I'm just, just guessing here. Let's say this little pocket isn't that great. And that's a good thing, though, because it's all similar. So, I mean, you could essentially click like this. If you had a property that's in there. So, it's just an example. But already, you know, you got 39 cash buyers right there. Just in that little thing. If that's, you know, so you can even start small if you want. Uh, but again, that's it. It's cash buyers. So click right there and then export. I add the list. You can find the list, export, done though. It's easy.